Hi everyone and welcome to another episode of our Mega Hood series. Today we are playing with caps. I decided to start at this at this big house. I don't think I have too much planned. The kid will be a teenager in this episode. The only thing I might have planned is the fact that I have noted that here is a pregnancy but I checked and nobody is pregnant. So I could make them a child. He wants to buy a vacation home. Okay. I would do it, but I have the, only the space added, and I don't think Dirk could buy a house in space. Dina wants to play with Nina, so I lock that in so she invites her sister or something to spend the time nicely and stuff. In the meantime, you two can try for baby. Let's just continue with the playing. They didn't have luck, so maybe next time. Okay, here's Nina. Your sister, you can play, I don't know. And you don't want to play with your sister anymore. Bubble blower. Okay, now you have your bubble blower. And you want to play with Darren, so you can invite him over too. It's some kind of a family reunion episode, I guess. I don't know. Like, we're playing all caps, but everyone else is inviting their family members. Dina seems happy with her bubble blower. Okay, it's next today fairly early, so you can try for baby, again. Alright, this time it worked, so we're gonna have a baby tomorrow, around this time. I like how she wants a car, but I don't have any place to place the car. Okay, I did something. I'm not saying it looks good, but it, it's something. Let's buy this one. Okay, that garage looks weird, but it's something. So now we have a car, which isn't painted inside, but that doesn't matter too much. Okay, she had to wear this one. I don't mind, I just think it's weird. I consider deleting one or few replacements for pregnancy outfits, because I sometimes think not many people would walk around like that, more would go with the default outfits. Some of the outfits... Oh, they got a promotion, that's good. I have to start thinking what aspiration would Flamenco be. He's really sloppy and lazy, really outgoing and playful and nice. And he's a Libra. So either a popularity or a romance, maybe pleasure. Okay, she started to give... She started giving birth, she got into labor. Random, let's... Yes, only one kid. And girl on the first try. Emilia sounds like a good name. I'll go with that. Emilia Cap. Okay, now it looks somewhat decent inside. It most likely won't be used because Dina wanted it and she doesn't have a job to go anywhere with it. I guess maybe Flamenco would get it after he gets after he becomes decent age. I don't remember if teenagers can drive in Sims 2. I know in Sims 3 they can learn how to drive and then drive. Okay, let's start with Emilia's birthday. Okay, let's see how she mixed. Then you're gonna age up right after. Let's wait till Flamenco ages up and then we're gonna... I'm gonna make him a romance and secondary popularity. And a popularity second, okay, okay. Now we're good. I think I could also give him a grilled cheese, as, as I think now. So yeah, I changed my mind. Okay, we're good now. So secondary romance and this thing goes into here. And yeah, become icon, okay. She seems more like Dirk. I'll keep her bald for now because I don't often have bald kids. And she has a nice dress which I'll keep too. Now let's check your appearance. Oh, you look pretty cute, especially from front, from side that 
nose looks really odd, but from front you look really nice. You have just two pairs of shorts. I mean, nobody stops you from wearing a sweater and shorts. Yeah, I'll go with that. Sweater and shorts, because why not? Oh, I can already give the card flamenco. That's cool. Also, I need to change your appearance once again, because your hair is straight when you take hat off. <laughs> okay, it's morning, so... Let's go to another cap family. The second cap family. Connor is gonna be older in this episode. She's painting Albany. I was gonna invite Glabe to move in because I wanted to do so between episodes. But I kinda forgot. Okay, I did it the rooms a little. We don't need all the rooms, so I have only this for the Hal and Glabe and this for Goneril. Connor wants to go to Far East vacation. I would book vacation now for like next rotation, but I have only only the space added, so I'll wait. She wants to woohoo even though she doesn't have anyone. She has Hello. chemistry with Cornwall, okay. Also she wants to buy new clothes, so I'll send you to community lot to do that. Go buy some new clothes for you and maybe for Glebe too, because your son has some nice outfits. Okay, I bought like these three outfits for Gonero, and I didn't find anything interesting for Glebe, so... She's gonna stay in what she has. I want to have 20 best friends. How many do you have? Like five. Not the worst, not the best. You have quite whole life before you, so... You can call someone, but it would be better if you had more. So yeah. So yeah, we're back. I accidentally had a game crash, but now we're good. And in meantime, I added the vacation I wanted to add, so... We're gonna go on vacation for three days on... On Monday, yeah. To Takemizu village and... And we'll pick a hotel later, I guess. And I think uh, she gave the car to Hall, but that didn't save as well. So we're good now. I think they could get married on the on the island. Why did I say island? They are going to to the far east, so like Takemizu village. But yeah, they could get married on vacation. I think it's possible. If not, then well, they're gonna get married after. But if it is, then good. This house is pretty good for having like maybe two kids. I don't think they would have more than one kid, especially that Hall has quite few siblings. And most likely all of them will have kids. It's possible that not all will, but most likely will. Maybe Miranda won't. That reminded me kind of a sim from my Four Corners, who was like a Roman sim who also didn't have kids, so... Maybe. And she had a lot of siblings too. A little more than Miranda, but still. I wanna show you my Four Corners one day, but... I, I give myself a goal that I have to play 100 days before I do so, so... That's a few more days to play. Gunner has a day off, of course. I'm gonna make her retire, because she only has days off and she's gonna age up today. And she doesn't have vacation days, so... Yeah, she's gonna retire. Okay, we got a free object from from Brandy. What did we got? A computer. Okay, it's not too bad. But we need some place to have it in. Maybe I'll make a small office here. Okay, this is good office. Oh wait, it's past 6 p.m. so... Actually, I'll wait till Hal comes back because it's... Already close to 8. Alright, that's nice. He got a promotion. So time for Gunner to age up. Haven't had a pre-made become an elder in a while. That's 
that's an interesting choice of of outfit. Now we should be good. She's retired business tycoon. Now let's change her outfit to something. Something from this. I don't remember which one I wanted. I guess I wanted this one the most. But yeah, I think I'll go with this one. All right, so that's a that's how Gunnar looks like as an older. In my opinion, she looks fine. I considered this hairstyle for a moment, but nah, I don't think it looks good. So, we finished with this family. Time to go to another one. So yeah, let's go to the last family for today and next uh, rotation here we're gonna have a vacation. And here we go with our last family for today. I don't think much will happen today. All I remember is that Cornwall will age up. Teens won't yet, so it's alright. But yeah, Cornwall will be an elder and I... And I think he's a day older than Goneril. Which I somehow didn't think of. Oh. Flamenco. And Viola. So like, families. I mean, one family. You're all related. You want to go to college and become an ecological guru, so I'm gonna look that in already. <laughs> He wants to become a celebrity chef and make out with Tiffany. He wants to buy new clothes, but I'm not sure if I want to send him to buy some. Especially that he wants to buy a car and get a promotion. Which won't happen too soon. I mean, I'm pretty sure he'll get a promotion on Monday, but that's gonna be next rotation because I finish on Monday. I'll lock that uh, one for now. If you don't take Japan. If you don't age up into anything interesting, then I'm gonna buy you something. Alright, time to age up. What did you do? Alright, so now we have old Cornwall, so yeah, let's check if you have something interesting. I see not really, so yeah, we're gonna go buy you some clothes. Cornwall's, Cornwall as an elder looks pretty interesting, I must say. Okay, I bought one outfit because I, I don't think I could find anything that looks good. So I think this is fine for him. And here she is. That's that's a quite expensive car for burps, but okay. I should start pairing these sims. After this episode I'm probably gonna just write down who's gonna be with who and it's gonna be easier from there. I mean who could be with who because I don't know what options I have, I don't know what I could do. I just noticed it's Monday so we're really close to finishing. He wants to buy new clothes already. Nah, you're gonna stay in that. And here Cornwall goes to work. And we're finishing the rotation. So that's all for today's episode. We had three cap families. And not too much happened here. We had a new baby in the first cap family. Goneril and her family went on vacation. Glaib finally moved in with Hal and went on vacation with them. Cornwall became an elder and I guess that's... I guess that's all. So, I hope I'm gonna be on track now with uh, episodes every Wednesday. I hope... I hope to keep that. How it'll go, we'll see, but yeah. Leave any opinions and suggestions in the comments and see you next episode. See you next Wednesday. Bye!